Welcome back. Still working here. You know, my initial thought was to put a fence, like an iron fence around here, but I've decided not to. I think I'll be fine with that one. I did want to put, holy cow, that's a fine tree. I'm going to put a couple trees in here. I don't think I need any over here. Although I will add... I'm just going to, you know, path this up. Where is my moss there? And then sticking moss underneath these just for consistency. And then kind of like I did over there, a couple plants. Because this nice big green carpet is nice. Nice, big, nice, that's kind of redundant. Nice is nice. This big green carpet is nice. However, I think it um, is a little bare. So it does need some plants, but I don't want to overwhelm it with plants. So I may add, if I add one here. Yeah, I think I can do that. Let's get... Um, Get the plain. I like the plain rather than the flowered. Oh, oh no. There we go. And I just need, I thought I saw, yes, oak. thought I saw some oak wood. Although you think azalea is a different tree, it wouldn't have oak wood, it would have an azalea wood. I'm sure that's how that works. I don't think an azalea tree is going to have oak wood. Maybe... Oh yeah, good. And it went the right way. I didn't want it to go towards the cathedral. I am going to keep this pretty plain. I'm not going to, you know, bone meal it up or do anything like that. Because I want it to look, I want to give it this nice clean look. And then we get over here, I am going to put in... I guess it would be right there. Yeah. Another another one of those small houses or small crypts. Let's see some polished. I need yes, there we go. Thought I brought stairs. Some stairs. This is mainly going to be all, you know, like this. Well, I think I, I'm going to, I think I may carry, no, I didn't want to do that. Maybe like that. balls do this here and here and I've got some yeah some plane and a site can go up here Nothing's in there. I mean, it's it's like a pseudo building, kind of like a set for a movie. And then I 
wonder. No, it won't do that. Oh yeah, it actually will. I was thinking if I do torch there, it will light things up, but you can't see it. Let's put, where's my stairs? So if we do, there. Oh, I need a cap though. I'm going to need a roof cap. Oh, it's dark already? How did it get so dark? I just started. Jeez, I'm not sure I like... I'm not sure I like this tree at all. I think I'm going to do a different tree here. But I don't like the way that cuts into the uh, road right there. So while I'm here, I'm going to just chop it down and start a new one. And you would think... Yeah, I'm completely disorganized over here. Oops. At least it's going to light it up. There we go. Yeah, I'm not sh quite sure what these above ground mausoleum crypts are for. I mean, I mean, aside from looking good, but I mean, from a technical point of view or a practical point of view, you think there's crypts underground. So maybe these are for people so important they can't fit into the underground crypts. Oh, ouch. Holy, speaking of underground. I am underground. I just I haven't done anything under there yet. Do these leaves not despawn? Oh, there must be a, um, a log in there, which is fine. I, I'll take those. So what's this? There we go. I mean, this looks a little. I mean, it looked a little funny on the sides. That's why I'm adding these in here, hoping to kind of do something with it. I, I'm not quite sure what the problem is. Yeah, it just looked too too tall and skinny. I need something on the walls there. And then we will oh, I do yeah, let's do this. Oh, I can't do that, can I? If I push that back one more, let's see what that does. So if I do this and put all that. Yeah, I think that'll be okay. That almost looks like you can see inside the crib. There, something like... There, like that. And I was going to put a flower there, but maybe I can. I can do this. I can put it there. Oh, no, I can't. Oh, yes, I can. I'm on the wrong block. There we go. There. And I was going to raise, initially I thought I was going to raise this up by one, but then I realized that I built my um, cathedral 
down one. So I'm not going to raise the whole thing up because this should be at ground level. So this technically this should be up one block, which means that whole building needs to go up one block. So everything in there would need to go up one block, which would mean me tearing it down and moving it up one block. There's no way in hell I'm doing that. I'm going to live with my mistake. So, so I had planned to put this, you know, this level all the way down there and then realize it's going to uh, shrink my building and I don't want to do that. So I think this, uh, so I'm going with this two tier and I think this looks okay. Since it's, I do kind of, I like the way this moss it works. It makes a nice clean, really nice clean uh, um, area here. So let's do this. I want a little bit of lighting over here, even though it, there's nothing spawnable. There we go. That, see, that lights it up, but you don't get the smoke from the torch because it's down one. So I may also do that like here. So if you put your torch way down there, and then you can double stack the carpet on top and the little smoke particles won't come through. If you go here, oh, can you not? I know through normal carpet, you can see the smoke particles. I don't see them. Interesting. Without light it up, I was trying to do strategic lighting through here. And then, uh, Let's see about collecting these because I can always use leaves. The azalea leaves are nice for decorating. Oh, yeah, I missed a lot of stuff. Oh, I had like a whole branch that went out over the road, which was fine if it was a bit lower. It was a little too, a little too, a bit taller, excuse me, a little too low. Did I? I must have planted. Uh, I must have planted something there. I was just trying to figure out what had rooted dirt, but I think maybe I had uh, tried it down at the ground level. Well, no, I didn't. I'm pretty sure I raised it up to, from the start. I don't know how the rooted dirt got all the way down there. Because I know I took the one out here, but I don't remember taking one down there. And I don't remember growing one that low. Unless I did, and I've already forgotten it. I mean, it's been, you know, probably uh, 10 minutes since I started recording. So how am I supposed to remember something I did 10 minutes ago? And this is where the leaves come in handy. Because I can do it. Like that. Although I should probably... Let's do... There. Yeah, that looks a bit better. Snow... Snow, snow, snow. But I am not seeing snow on top of things. You know, they need a flowered uh, moss carpeting. There we go. There. Um, Okay. 
Oh, good. I don't see any snow. Oh, dang it. I see snow on that. Yeah, I'm going to have to go up here and put cart moss on top of all these trees. Let's take a look from up here. Let's see, it doesn't really block that much of a view. Oh, actually, it looks pretty good from up here, especially uh, with all the trees and stuff. Ooh, look at that! Got a nasty little spot right there, which I bet would be spawnable if there's no snow on it. If I, oh, I was pretty sure I had overlay and overlay enabled. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. That's not, okay. That's not such of a problem. I thought uh, something could spawn there, but it, uh, if it, I have a dent, have a have a dent. Jeez, Louise. I should just start over. I can't talk. Evidently, nothing can, uh, spawn there i should probably carry bricks over here getting distracted what i was doing is just looking at this this looks really good i think especially i love the green it's nice green it's much better than just the grass and it's a hell of a lot better than the snow so i don't like the snow down here oh it definitely needs a a brick you know, brick stairs or what is that wall? Brick wall. Uh, oh, there we go. Get my stone cutter. You know, now we got the stone cutter. I don't even remember. You have trouble remembering how to make some blocks the old fashioned way. I mean, honestly, you can remember. It's just like squares and angles and that kind of stuff in there. But you're so used to just putting them in the stone cutter and getting your things that when I put them in a crafting table, I don't even. It's like, oh, I'm in the wrong one. I can't make something, but I can. I just, for some reason, just you're so used to using it that you just won't use the normal table. So now we have this all laid out here. I did go through and add a few, uh, a few plants scattered here and there. I'm not going to put anything in this area. I'm going to leave this kind of bare all through here, except over on this side. Now that I got the look, and I think this would be a good spot for a second mausoleum here. And then it would also go, if it's going to be like, let's, let's lay this out while we're here. Let's see, come up here. That's about central. Let's do... So that would be the lead up to it. And then we would go into three like here. And one, two, three here. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, yeah. And then we would go in. So this would be wall. Give it a couple paces in. And then the, the stairs down would start here. Boy, that's a long way down. So it would actually be here. So it would be... I think the other one was two wide. And this one's going to be three wide. We'll do three wide on this one. And let's see. Can I get... Up, oh, dang it. I was... Trying for some tricky parkour. It didn't work. Let's pick up all these. Okay, this is good. It's on the, just on the inside. So I can stay inside. I'll have to cut down these trees and stuff, I think. But. Yes. Sir. Stairs here. Stair. 
there. How far are we going to go down? I don't know. I think I'm going to have to clear out a lot of this anyhow. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out of blocks. Well, here's the other stairs for these guys. So this is where the living quarters for the priests would be, which actually works pretty good. If I run it all the way up to the wall, this is going to be a wall right there. I could actually put windows in there and doors down here so they could get in and out through there. They wouldn't have to go through the church. And then this is when it leads them all the way up into the pulpit area. Because this is going to be leveled off right about there, probably. It'll be leveled off at a certain height. So I'll have a, probably have a door here and a door down there because it's going to be leveled off there. I really need to level that off. So that way I can get a good look at everything. Oops, what was I doing? I think I was going here. Like that. Can I do that? Yeah. Yeah, so this, so I could do, can I hit my head? I won't hit my head if it's like that. And it will be up one anyhow, so this will be more than enough. And then I guess the back corner of the building, I don't want it too close, so maybe here and here. So we'll build another mausoleum similar to that one. Except it will be on this level. Where did you come from? Oh, portal. Yep. <clears throat> so let's see. I'm going to do... What? That glitch is still there. I think it's... It's going to be there forever. Let's see. We go here. Do that. Oops, no. Of course it snows. Everyone likes the snow, don't they? Jeez. There. Is it nighttime? I don't think it's nighttime yet either. Very simple floor like we had in the other one. So this will be our stairway down, obviously. This will take us into the underground here. So I figure there'll be, uh, it'll come into like a little chamber here. And then there'll be a passageway that runs all the way through there and almost probably meets up with that other one. So be a chamber here, maybe this would be a central passage. And then there'll be little crypt areas off to either side there. Except for that corner, this corner over here will be, so there'll be, I could put the wall right there, I guess. So the stairs come right down the wall and we get into the priest's area right there. So there'll be living quarters and stuff here, probably a two story. So there'll be a one level here, one level down there where we meet. So we'll have a door out there and a door out here. So things are taken. Plans are coming together. I'm you're watching me plan on the fly. There. Hmm. 
Okay, that's good. So good so far. Something like that, yeah. Gonna make a a grand old entrance there. Where's the cobblestone? And this one, the other one, I didn't have any any windows at all. I think I'm going to put just these barred windows right there. I am mixing up my block types just to keep it I think it looks better with the mixed up block types and then even on the outside here I'll be running like pillars down that way and then maybe yours yeah end of sight so it kind of gives it a columned look right there it is nighttime so maybe I should go get a little bit of shut eye come back and finish this there tiny little window there when you come in here Let's, oops. Oh, I've got dirt. That'll work. Let's look for scaffolding, but I must have dropped it off someplace. Let's see. I'm trying to think of how I want this roof to go. I think for this one, I am going to actually start on the outside of these columns. Like that. I may have to make some adjustments to the ends and the sides. There. And hopefully, hopefully it'll be okay. Just trying to mix it up a bit.
put that there and then I've got let's see do I have got some andesite stairs I think that would look nice kind of break up the monotony of the brick and the cobblestone and it ties it into this uh, wall that's underneath it Across here and then maybe a heavy capstone in the end there normally I'll do like a wall but I think putting that chiseled stone or chisel block will work here let's go down and take a look or go over here and take a look well, that's looking good, except I've got dirt in the way. Oh yeah, that's not bad at all. It kind of blocks the side of this zombie. I almost need to do something with that. You know, I put glass there, but it almost looks like it doesn't have anything there. It almost looks like it's a, a problem. Like I forgot something. I may. I may end up cladding this in. Like wall. Stone brick, cobblestone, andesite. Sort of do a, this wall pattern up the side of the zombie. Um, it won't take out too much of the arm. Or maybe remove the. Remove the glass, put a little wall bit behind there, clad this whole thing in wall. You'll still see this side. I still don't know. Something about it. I mean, I, I thought it was a good idea at the time. However, it kind of clashes with the rest of the building now. I think, yeah, so maybe just kind of finishing it out like it's one of the other towers. So you can only see it from that direction. And it probably wouldn't be too, it probably wouldn't hurt if I just did this whole thing in a wall. Not sure what to do about the top. Maybe do a crenellation on the top there. On that side and the other side. I don't want to put a roof on them. Okay, so let's go in here. Get rid of this snow. Get rid of the snow. Okay. Yeah, so that's looking pretty good. Yeah, I do like, good thing I left that. That, that actually works out. And then maybe a yeah, stone brick will do this. What did I do over there? Oh, I'm missing that. There we go. Um, there's the andesite, andesite, andesite. And then stone brick, like that. So we're going to got a very tall, very tall roof. And then I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. No. I just think of something to cover up this hole here. And then here, like that. Yeah, because I'm going to have. wall all around there and then going down we'll have like kind of a mix
there until I can figure out what level this is. We'll just go there so far. Ouch. Yeah, I left this place kind of a mess down here. I didn't didn't really take time to clean anything up. So. Or at least it gets me gets me down here now. Okay, I think I think that's going to do it for the mausoleum part. They need to do some interior decorations on it. But oh, what did I not do there? Oh, maybe I need to go one higher. Because I need to block the inside and the outside. Oops, let's go through here. Oops, come on. There. Okay, so it looks kind of bulky there. That'll be better. Oh yeah, that'll be much better. Uh, and then the outside here, it will look pretty good there. Yeah, I, I, I think that'll work. The only thing I may add... I think I need to do this. Just getting just another row of column. Column there, and then maybe a column like that. It doesn't really need to meet up. It just needs to be kind of there. That's got a lot of cobble in it. A lot of cobble. And maybe some of these can be andesite. Of course, I could play around with this all day. These are the kind of things that are, you can just keep tweaking and tweaking and tweaking and constantly tweaking and never quite get it perfect. So I think I'm going to leave it. So now we have two entrances. You got the mausoleum down there and the mausoleum here. So that'll take us down into the crypts. And I showed you the layout I'm going to have for the priest quarters. So I really need to, uh, I need to light this up or something. I need to figure something about, something here with this. I hate to cover up all this mossy brick, but I may have to put gray, gray um, what is that called? Uh, wool. <laughs> I forgot that. One. Holy cow. Time for me to go. Yeah, I'll have to figure something out here. So I think that'll take care of things for today. Thanks for watching. Um, I will be back in the next episode to continue working. But until then, have a great day, and I will see you all later. Bye-bye.